Hey, Jeffrey, did you know the holiday seasons are coming up? Oh, my God, really? Really? And you know really? what that means? Awesome games. Awesome games. <laughs> this is uh, <laughs> Jeff and his retarded friend, Adam. Hey, everybody. <laughs> We're going to talk about video games that are coming talk, out this fall. Talk about this fall's uh, game releases. Let's get started. You know, as a fat, overweight comic book nerd, I'm looking forward to DC Universe Online. Oh, uh, my I'm God. I'm actually kind of looking forward mm. to see how it comes out. Mm, I'm going to play as Harlequin and just keep touching myself. Now, he's really going to create a guy named Sergeant Manhammer and go around showing Hell, people yeah. his Manhammer. That's, that's my superpower. But the great thing about DC Universe Online is you don't only have to play the DC comic book characters. You can make your own character. And my character is going to be called the Velvet Serpent. Finally, a video game that makes you look even more pathetic than my comic book t-shirts and collection of trade paperbacks. Thanks, DC. You forgot the tricks t-shirt. Wah, wah. The game I'm most excited about is actually an expansion this fall. It's World of Warcraft Cataclysm! Yeah, I gotta say, even me, a person with an active social life, when I saw the Cataclysm footage, I was like, wow, maybe I could just waste my life in the basement with Jeff. He's always available when we need to get together to film. It's gonna be awesome. Morgan, goblins, all kinds of character class combos, new areas, totally old areas, reworked. Check it out. You know what I'm excited for? Getting laid. Yes. Um, but more than that, the apocalypse. And that's why I can't wait for Fallout New Vegas. New mm. Vegas, not to be confused with old Vegas. What could be better than going to Las Vegas and killing everybody? Including this lounge singer. I think, I think if anybody out there has been to Las Vegas, you know the only thing that could improve it is nuclear annihilation. So go out there and get... Fallout New Vegas. But make sure you get the hookers out of there first. We want to keep it. Yeah, actually, we want to keep the hookers. This fall is the fall of the motion controllers. Motion! Ah, fuck. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, this fall is going to be Dance Central, which I'm really excited about on Connect. I'm going to get my groove on without Adam. Oh, shuck it. Shuck it. I think I'm bleeding. Finally, a game where Adam and I can get our groove on together once again. Awkward. This is how rumors start. Every year during this magical season, I like to pick one game that's a real turd. You know, like an Iron Man 2 or an E.T. the video game. Really, he just likes games that smell like his ass. I really like shitty games. And this year, I think the best crappy game is going to be Arcadia Gothic 4. Not sure what it's about, but judging from the trailer, it's about a shepherd who takes up jogging. But you end up getting a sword and kill lots of monsters that kind of look phallic. So, what's the problem with that? You are so gay. My favorite game that's coming out this fall is October 26th. That's not a game. Uh, yeah. I don't know if you've seen the release. It, it kind of is. We got Rock Band 3, Fable 3, Star Wars Force Unleashed 2, and WWE Raw vs. SmackDown 2011. Same day. That midnight launch is going to be off the shizzy. Those are going to be the worst, most annoying lines on earth. Dude, I'm going to go bankrupt that day. Between the Rock Band expansions and all the other games. Oh, shit. I'm going to go bankrupt watching the WWE fans beat up the Rock Band kids. What I'm really curious about is can a drumstick beat a Jedi lightsaber? Yeah. You know the saddest things in those lines? Is that the Fable fans, uh, every decision they make while in the line affects their total outcome. So those are the video games we're interested in, but we'd love to hear from you. So please put your comments down here and tell us what fall video games you want to see. And also, don't forget you can always put in a video response. Narcissistic Loser put a great one on for our Boba Fett vs. Deadpool video. We'll show a little clip after the break, but we'd love to hear your video responses as long as they're not vulgar or uh, self-advertising. We will post them. Um, my name is Narcy. You can find me on YouTube. Um